breast cancer deaths are slowly going down, but significant racial and regional disparities remain. African American women, women in poorer communities, and women in rural areas have less access to mammography. This can lead to less timely diagnosis and treatment, which impacts breast cancer survival. African American women are 42% more likely to die from breast cancer than white women. They have a two-fold higher risk of aggressive, so-called triple negative breast tumors. They are less likely to be diagnosed with stage one breast cancer, but twice as likely to die of early breast cancers. In fact, since 1990, breast cancer deaths have dropped 23% in African American women, compared to a 37% drop in white women. While Hispanic women are less likely to get or die from breast cancer than whites, it remains the leading cause of cancer death among Hispanic women. For Hispanic women, breast cancers are diagnosed later than whites due to lack of screening, leading to the five-year breast cancer survival for Hispanic women being lower than those of white women. And the breast cancer death rate is going down more slowly among Hispanic women than in white women. Women who live in rural areas are less likely to be screened and are more likely to die of breast cancer than those in metropolitan areas. The breast cancer death rate is also declining more slowly in rural areas than in larger cities. All women deserve a chance at early diagnosis. They need access to high quality mammography in their communities. Most importantly, screening should start no later than 40 and be done yearly. All women, especially African American women, should have a risk assessment to see if screening earlier than age 40 is needed.